Hello friends, welcome to HTML tutorial series. I double click on the first page.html. I right click once again on the first page.html open with the notepad. In the previous tutorial, we understood that if we need to convert a text to hyperlink or any section of our web page to hyperlink, we are going to use the anchor tag or simply a tag. Anchor tag has an attribute called as hyperlink reference that is href. It takes the page to which we need to navigate. You can see here I have written click me to navigate to second page. It is not necessary to write click me to navigate to second page this much content. I just put here in between the anchor tags. I just write second page file save go to browser refresh. You can see that second page text got displayed in a blue color underlined by seeing that you should understand that this is a hyperlink. Now how do you identify something is a hyperlink? All you need is you need to move the mouse cursor on an area. When you move the mouse cursor on an area or a section of your web page, if the normal mouse cursor changes to the hand cursor, you should understand that that is a hyperlink. If you find a text as a blue colored and underlined, you should understand that it is a hyperlink. When a text is a hyperlink, we normally say as hypertext. We can even convert an image to a hyperlink. Even we can convert some section of the page to a hyperlink by using the anchor tag. If anybody asks, how do you identify something is a hyperlink? You should say that when I move the mouse cursor on some area, if the normal mouse cursor changes to the hand cursor, then we can say that is a hyperlink and that section is a hyperlink. Simple. Now we are going to, okay, this one I saved file save. I close this also. Let me right click and open with notepad. I open the second page here. Also, I just put first page file save I double click on the second page dot html okay it is displaying second page good now you need to observe something I double click on the first page dot html Firefox got open if I click on the second page second page will get open in the same window if I click on this you can see that second page got open in the same page if I click again on the first page the first page will get open in the same window we can create more windows in Firefox by clicking on this plus symbol. There are some situations where you want to navigate from first page to second page and uh, you, you might be interested to open that second page in some other window, not in the same window. How do you do that? First thing I right click on the first page dot HTML open with the notepad uh, to open the page in the same window or in the another window. We are going to use an attribute called as target T A R G E T target. Target takes two values mainly. One is underscore self, another one is underscore blank. To the target, I give underscore self self. File, save, go to browser, refresh. If I say target self, means the page, the second page dot HTML is going to open in the self window, that is in the same window. Check this out. If I click on this, you can see that second page got open in the same window understanding so by default target is set to self you can think like that similarly if i click on this first page link first page will get open in the same window even though we have not mentioned that in the second page target self by default target is set to self so here i can say target equal to underscore self self double quotation file save go to browser refresh no change you can see that both are opening in the same window okay now this time what i do means i open the first page dot html with the notepad and instead of target underscore self i mention underscore b l a n k blank file save check out what happens if i open right click on the first page open with the firefox check this time what happens if i click on the second page link if i click on this you can see that the second page dot html got open in another window if i click on the first page we know that the first page has uh, in the second page here second page dot html open with the notepad you can see that target is set to self so if i click on this first page will get open in this window 
you can see that it has got open in the same window if i again click on the second page we know that the second page target is set to another window so another window got open if i click on the first page on the first page of course the first page target is set to same window so it will get open in the same window if you want to open on another windows then you need to use target as underscore b l a n k blank file save now we have set both the links as a blank right click open with the notepad you can see that i set here target as underscore blank here also i right click open with the notepad i set the target as a blank so whenever i click on any link the page is going to open in the next window you can see i click on the second page it got open in another window i click on the first page it got open in the another window i click on the second page it got open in the another window so you should remember the difference between underscore self and underscore blank hope you guys have understood how we can use a target attribute for this tutorial this much is enough friends in the next tutorial we get more information on html for more benefits please subscribe like comment and share